Hey folks, we're back. Choosing our production in this city. Let's try to get a commercial hub up in here. There's plus three, so that's actually going to make it 26 turns now. Because uh, we removed the production that we already had there. Move them over here where our other bombards are. We are losing 17 gold per turn right now. Alright, bombard. I guess you can't move there because of all the freaking apostles. Spreading lots of religion. How is he doing in that regard? These are Macedons, and he only has one, so it's fine. Alright, you've completed more cavalry. Well, I don't know how much more we can take. Go for a... Uh, well, you already have a commercial hub. You are almost housing capped. I would like to say build more units, but, I mean, at some point in time, we got to stop. Go for a uh, military academy. These guys can come over here, and seven turns will get you guys linked up. We're going to stop on steel. Went a little bit too far there. And we're going to work on industrialization eventually. Let's go back to square rigging. All right. Staples are done. Commercial hub for sure. Plus three. Yeah. Got a bank being completed. Rome did get a great scientist. So are there any more? No, there are not. Mastodon, 31 point, uh, great general points per turn. That's crazy. All right, fortify up. All right, trader, go to... Yeah, for nine? That sounds great to me. Once we're able to core, we'll probably start a war. Hey, Greg Yankee, welcome back. Still in the same game as last time, I think you saw. All right, you want open borders? You're actually willing to pay me for it. I mean, I'm fine, but give me a little bit more than that. I mean, this isn't even really... Gosh, I don't care. Sure. You're at war right now. You're not doing that great. Last I looked, St. Petersburg was having some issues. I would know. I have a spy there. Speaking of which, he has just gained some sources and is going to steal a tech boost. 90% chance of success there. City needs more amenities. Yep. Nationalism 4. Then all of these units can finally get cored up. And we can go to war. All right, Eureka for economics, because we have a second bank. I think so. That will be very handy, because we need it. All right, go for a shipyard. We can't really support any more units at this time. We need more cities. Uh, you've completed it. Go for a market. Bombard, roll on up. You can core up here in just a bit, I think. Maybe one of them's going to be out. Why don't you come up this way and you come here into the city? That's the forward city, so that's where they would start to come from. The units that are, that is. All right, you can go to Ace for eight gold, or we can send you to St. Petersburg for eight plus a lot of other things. So let's do that instead. Macedon completed research on combustion. All right, one more turn till nationalism. Workshop is complete. Let's go for a commercial hub here in Great Yankee. And we're going to go with plus three right here, but that's a good one. So let's go with it on the jungle instead. So everyone's going to get in on the action of the commercial hubs. We can upgrade you to a field cannon, but right now I don't want to upgrade any of my units just yet. When you're losing 25 per turn, you don't want to do that. Uh, Bombard, you're going to make your way here. And next turn, we'll have nationalism finally. Then we can maybe take Ace back. It's, it does have borders, or walls, but it, they're not very strong. All right, let's do this. Damn apostles. What is this, cavalry? Cavalry needs to come over to the other cavalry. And now these cavalry can army, or core up, like so. Like so. This is a musketman who's going to core up with 
this musky men, this one's gonna core, core up with this one, this one with this one, this cavalry with this cavalry, this cavalry with this cavalry. We've got one cavalry left. Damn it. Yes, I do. Uh, Sokka Horse Archer with Sokka Horse Archer. Crossbowman with Crossbowman. Horse Archer. Crossbowman with Crossbowman. Now, all of our archers, archer units, can't upgrade to field cannons, but it's going to cost me some cash that I don't necessarily have yet. All right, there we go. So there are there are our three bombards. This guy's still an archer. We have one excess cro uh, cavalry. It appears. Okay. And then this is our single knight that will upgrade later to a tank. All right, choosing our next civic. Well, we want to get to what? Mobilization, I think. Seven, grow city to size 15, and earn a great merchant. That's not going to happen. Let's just hard research them. Go for it. Okay, so next we'll start moving our forces here. We'll have our bombards first. Uh, they are aligned with Macedon, so we have to be prepared for some type of attack. And they would then come from Dion. Dion, we probably do need to actually upgrade you. We're making 15 gold per turn now. So I guess whenever you core units, that actually... Yeah, it does. It reduces maintenance. I didn't realize that. That's awesome. Sweet. Counts them as one unit. Now we're actually making gold. Okay. Then I might even upgrade a couple of these crossbowmen. Or promote, rather. We'll do that next turn. You've completed the university. Go with Renaissance Walls. And the next turn. Sweet. All right, he wants open borders. I'm gonna refuse it. So the plan of attack would be eventually take Pella, and right now, because they don't have a city here, it would be pretty, uh, and it's all flat tile for the most part, and there, are, there is an encampment right here that we know of. It should be relatively, um, not easy, but uh, I guess relatively not too difficult. Let's just say that. How much does it cost to upgrade? Oh, field cannon, 350, geez. We have, that's with the professional uh, army too, wow. All right, so I want our bombards up first. This Saka Horse Archer is going to come back. Bombard, you move up there. God damn it, that's a long ways. Cavalry. Musketmen. Cavalry. 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 Now get over there, and this one there. All right, it is only 2.30 actually to upgrade this crossbowman core. So it's just more to upgrade a unit that's even more ancient than that, such as the Saka Horse Archer. Okay, and this knight is really not gonna be used for much. He's just a single knight, and it's not gonna do much for us. Okay, so this is our single cavalry though, so I'm gonna try to bring him back so we can pinpoint where he is. And you can go to alert. We'll move you around here in just a bit. I don't have anything I wanna trade. Now we have our two um, horses back too, so not at this time, Trajan. And since we do have that, after this military academy is done, we'll go back to building cavalry and we get two for one. So fortify up. Uh, Saga Horse Archer, come back. Get out of the way, actually. Bombard is going straight up. You're going to come here. Yeah, you can just kind of come up from behind, it's fine. 
They don't have much there. They just have a single crossbowman. And um, we'll just move up our, our bombards pretty soon. Their walls are only 50. Dion will be harder. They do have an encampment, but we're going to come from this side. They will have units that are going to come, but we have Renaissance walls in the city. We have the the uh, uh, mountains here to defend us. And our units are right next door as well. Buddy, you gotta eat, man. We're getting ready to uh, attack Geneva and take back... Well, it used to be called Geneva. We renamed it after one of our subscribers, Ace. We're gonna try to take that one back and then probably march on over to Dion, assuming that they don't bring too many crazy units our way. He thinks we control very little territory. Well, we're gonna try to control a little bit more. All right. We did get the, uh, the Eureka here for industrialization. That's why it's only five more turns. And we also built a market. Now we're making 20 gold per turn. So we've got a, two commercial hubs, three commercial hubs, a bank. All right, we've got... Actually, Renaissance Walls is four turns from being completed here, too. So that's even more... That's even uh, better. Let's move you there. This one's still coming here. Sokka Horse Archer will upgrade later. This is our field cannon, which it can move up. This Crossbowman Corps can upgrade here soon enough. Uh, Chilwell says, in my game, I took out Germany rather quickly, but now I think I am biting off more than I can handle with the Aztec. The Aztec are tough when it comes to, yeah, their military. Very tough. Let's move this Sokka Horse Archer in. And we'll upgrade this one, hopefully, here in just a little bit. All right, you can stay put. You can stay put. Next turn. All right. You move there so this guy can move there eventually, and then you go there. Game plan. Once this apostle leaves, we'll maybe move this um, crossbowman core back. Ah, oh, this damn apostle is good. We have the Eureka for stealth tech, because we stole it. And we have a promotion available for this guy. So this will be his second promotion. The last one we got was uh, 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 disrupting... No, it was rocket scientist? I don't know what the hell it was. But it was so that he could uh, steal tech boost. And now we're going to go for ace driver. So if we do get caught, we have a better chance of getting away. The other good one is is um, con artist to siphon funds, because I like to do that. But this is our second uh, promoted spy. He should be ready to start disrupting spaceports here in one more promotion. Uh... Military Academy is complete. Let's go back to building cavalry, and let's build cavalry cores. Now, even if you build cavalry cores, you'd still get one single cavalry uh, afterwards as a, you know, our uniqueness. So it's not like you get two cavalry cores. Uh, how do you know what era you were in? Go up here to the tech tree, and you can see here, I'm in the industrial era, uh, and once I get steel here in very very soon in fact i'm going to switch right now uh i will be in the modern era this, yep there you know there you go all right let's move you back this damn bombard's going to try to move up here in a bit this one can move there all right so now um to boost hold on i need to find out if i have coal first because if I have coal, then I don't need to continue working on that. And I do not see any. None at all. Anything here? In Geneva? No. I don't see coal anywhere at all. Not even in this unexplored, or the territory that we haven't taken. Uh, or even up here. Geez. There's not a lot of it. Alright. That's unfortunate. So we're going to go right back to steel then. We had um, stopped working on it so that we could see if we could find the uh, any coal. Let's move you up here. And then we'll hold tight. You are a four promoted core. It's incredible how well your promotions are. Uh, you are also four, which is also incredible. All right, Bombard, stay in this territory. All 
We're not going to have enough to upgrade you guys, I don't think, to an artillery. Let's move you here. We might just try to wait four turns and get some more cash before we do declare. Right, fortify there. But other than that, we're ready to go. Um, let's try to steal a, a boost for rocketry now. If we succeed, that'll be our third. Promotion. It'll only take... It's still eight turns, yeah, because we didn't get the uh, linguist promotion. Ironclad over here. Just a melee unit, so it cannot range attack us. Uh, three turns until steal. Choosing our production up here. We've completed the uh, Renaissance Walls. That's great. Let's go with a commercial hub. Plus two on any of these. Uh, here's a tile that hasn't been approved. Let's build it there. Still working on the cavalry core here. Where we'll get three cavalry out of it. And then one of those three will go hook up with this cavalry and then become a core. All right, last turn. Uh, we do need some cash. So how about instead of this, you just give me straight whole cold hard cash. Huh. All right, I don't want the uh, per turn stuff. So it's not three. Or it's not four hundred. Three seventy five. Three sixty. About three fifty. Nope. About three forty. All right, three forty. And two of our excess. All right, I'm fine with that. I need the cash. Or gold in this instance. Because in one turn, I'm going to be upgrading these three, hopefully. What's it going to cost? 230. So I can get two of them, but not the third, unfortunately. It's all right. Steel. Do I need two sources of iron? I don't think I do. I can get rid of one of those excess iron. Uh, let's go for replaceable parts. Flight is... I need both of these. So let's just do this one. This is four turns to six turns. Ten turns to get to this. If we wanted to go straight for flight, it would be 25 turns altogether. All right. I don't think I do. Um, Trajan, how much cash do you have? 732. And you need iron, so you're probably going to pay me all of it. Seven? Six, five, four, three, two, oh, come on. One. Hey, it's it's 30 gold. Add it up. It's worth it. All right, ups, let's upgrade you as well. All right, now then this crossbowman core can upgrade. We have our inspiration for Scorched Earth. Most of our units are upgrade, upgraded. think we can take this city now. God, I would hope so. And then we'll march on to Dion. All right, whatever you're about to do, don't do it. So we'll go next turn. You've completed your commercial hub. Go for not an armory yet. I do want that soon, but go for a market now. I could upgrade you. You're a musketman. And I could upgrade you to a field camp. We have increased trade route capacity. I need to get another trader here soon. Let's go to, well, we're, we may be at war here very soon, so let's go to St. Pete. I was going to say we may be at war with um, Alex, because he is the suzerain of Ace-14 now. He used to be called Geneva. But just because we declare war on Geneva doesn't mean that we declare war on him automatically. This Sokka Horse Archer is going to move in. Although it did give us an opportunity to kind of stop them from landing before, so maybe we'll just keep that. Alright, so I think it's time to stop delaying this and go to war. Thinking about it too much. Hello, artificially! We just declared war! Alright, so we are still at peace with uh, Alex. Maybe there. Maybe there. There. And you can actually move up next turn. How do we want to move you now? Let's 
go with our cavalry here first. Nope. Oh wait, this is field cannon. Why do I always get those guys mixed up? They look so identical to me. Field cannon and artillery crew. Uh, this is cavalry that needs to get up in the fight. And this is also cavalry that can come somewhere over here. Field cannon cores can come up. And, uh, yeah, it's not France. You're right. He doesn't like it. Hey, we're... You're giving us a lot of gold to help help with this, so thanks. All right, they didn't do much to us, which is what I like. This is artillery. This field cannon can move up. This artillery can move here. This one can move there. You can move there for now. You're going to move here. So artillery, field cannon, field cannon, artillery. This artillery is going to move up too. Cavalry, come down this way. Cavalry, dump, come down this way. Here, just filter on in. <laughs> Thanks, Craig Yankee. Hey, that's a that's a fine question. If you don't know, I bet you do now because you asked. So good job asking. All right, um, let's go for another. Damn it, that spy is going to take too long. We won't do that. We'll go with a water mill, and then we're definitely going to pick a spy in this one. Uh, I also want a trader, so the next one is going to have to get a trader going. Ah, here are holy shit. We actually do get two cavalry corps. I thought uh, Scythia's uniqueness their advantage was that when you built okay one cavalry you get a second cavalry i didn't realize that when you build one cavalry corps or one cavalry army you also get a cavalry corps or a cavalry army wow that's awesome i was expecting it to be like just a single cavalry that's great all right, uh, campus is complete here. Let's go for the lighthouse repair. And let's not upgrade you yet. All right, artillery core. Well, field cannon is eventually going to move on. You can actually hit the city, though. Let's at least get that started. Why don't you hit the city? Just to say we have. All right, everyone's gonna hold tight. All right, trader, go to 